Potter's training video on how to set the network ID and panel ID on your control panels. Panel and network ID must be set before the panel will recognize the NCE and NCF 1000 network cards during a panel learn function. Whether it's for an existing networked panel or whether it's for a new panel, it's the same process. We'll begin by pressing enter on the keypad. Number six, programming. Then we'll go to number six, network options. So to set the panel ID, we'll press one. I already have this panel ID set up as three, but if I wanted to change this to two, I could press zero, zero, two. And then I can press enter to save this. So a panel ID is gonna be similar to a node number on a network system. In addition to that, when setting up a panel ID, one control panel on the network has to have a panel ID set up as one. Every other control panel can have a different numerical value. And then the same for the network ID, you press two. Now typically for the network, all the control panels are gonna be on the same network unless it's a special application. So again, majority of the time, you're gonna have all of your control panels on a network ID of one. Then from there, we'll press escape and keep pressing escape to accept the changes and then the panel will reboot. Thanks for watching this video. For more questions about peer-to-peer -peer networking with the Potter panels, please contact tech support at the email address or phone number shown on the screen. And don't forget to follow us on social media.